Okay. That's inspiring confidence, isn't it? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Soma. Where a most horrific deed has been done. This is Simon. And this that I'm playing as, also Simon. I think I'm a clone now. There's always two of me just a hanging around. I could drain him. I could kill him right now. But I don't think I will. I'm gonna let him live. If he decides he wants to take his own life, that'll be his prerogative. But I'm not gonna take it for him. He'll have to make that decision for himself. You know what I'm saying? He could easily do it. All he has to do is just... Actually, no, you would need to swipe the Omni tool. I'm sure he'd find some way to drain his battery or something, right? But I'm not gonna do it myself. Excellent. I always love that reflection effect. Actually, I should probably turn the... No? Should probably turn the game's audio down a bit because it appears to be overpowering me on OBS and I don't want any more videos where I can't be heard, you know? That'd suck. Although, thankfully, it only seems to overpower me in very select circumstances. Access granted. Okay, access granted. Are you going to grant the access? Excellent. Well, the odds of me being attacked underwater are probably pretty rare. Probably pretty small, right? This is usually the more atmospheric points. I probably have much more to worry about falling to my death than being killed by a monster. Or a ro psycho robot. Same thing, really. Okay, so that ladder is clearly out. Is there any other way down? I have to observe the situation carefully before I make anything rash. Yes, good. See, I probably would have jumped down, not even looking around first. I gotta be better about that. I have to look around, actually pay attention to stuff, you know? Excellent. See? I would have completely missed this actual intact ladder. I'm glad I actually paid attention for once, huh? What do we have here? Are we done here? Yeah. Activate the clamor, please. Sure thing. Activate the what? Oh, descend? Passengers, one. Well, technically one. Okay, what now? I assume what we need to do is descend, right? Okay. Is there some other button I need to press? Oh, my bad. I have to actually initiate the thing. Take a seat and we'll be off. Okay. I'm done. Rich and light and oxygen. Pathos 2, main plateau. The Twilight Zone, is that where we're in? Do -do 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 -do. And I woke up in the right body. It's a redundant copy. I'll never experience my journey, the full journey. He wouldn't understand. How could he? I couldn't do it, and you knew it. You were right in trying to hide him from me. Only wish you'd done a better job. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right sign. Christ. This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind? Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Let me say something. I don't want to think. Please. 
I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist's brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. Profound. I was back in Toronto. Even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? I'd still be alone. No friends. You have her, no don't family. you? You could make new friends. I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. <laughs> if not, you still have... You, right? Wow. The power would have to go out right as she's saying that, right? You still have me. No, you don't. Yeah. Hello, Catherine. What happened? Well, this... This is very unfortunate, isn't it? Okay, let's get to this. You okay, Kath? What happened? I can't even take the Omni tool back out. It's locked into place, it seems. Did the power go out? Do I have to reset something? A breaker or something? I'm not exactly going to leave her here. Okay, here we go. Okay, that's probably it. The power. I need to trip it. Hey, I know it's not much, but why don't we stop moving? The power blacked out for a moment. I think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. Comforting. It will hold. Thanks. Thanks for the does, voted confidence. Does time freeze when you're not powered? Time feels omitted. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes. But generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. <laughs> it's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. Well, Gee, thanks. Worst. Gee, thanks, Catherine. Thanks for that. Now you're just being a jerk. A straight-up douchebag. Uh-oh. What's happening? Oh, great. It's one of those creatures again. You did it. You did it. I did what? What did I do? I didn't do anything. I'm a victim of circumstance, I tells you. 
And I will keep saying that until I believe it. What just happened? Everything blacked out. Well, obviously the game is still functioning. It made a brain load. I tell you, you can tell the game is still working. Oh, good, you're back. That what was happened? terrifying. Something dropped onto the cage. Knocks you right out. Spoke to me. Looks like a man, one of WoW's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. That's weird. Said it would make preparations. I don't like the sound of that. It was very strange. I thought it was going to kill you for sure. I'm glad it didn't. Yeah, me too. That was a close one, huh? Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good. Not sure the climber could take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. I expect we'll Great. have to do some walking before we reach Tau. You haven't been here before? Not in a way that'll help us. Right, the author you has been here. I'm following in your old footsteps, Cat. When I had footsteps. You could still be down here somewhere, technically. Don't remind me, freaks me out. Alright, let's head for Tau. Oh, you don't want to have to see yourself, huh? That would be. That would be horrible, wouldn't it? Having such an existential crisis, huh? Yeah, I bet you wouldn't like it very much, would you? Sorry. This whole thing has been a little twisted. Sorry. Okay. I'm back now. Fully. Offline, huh? Cool. Awesome. Error. Loomer link needed to call climber. Fantastic. What do we have here? What the? Oh, data buffer. Bring Tau. it on, baby. Come in, Tao. Please answer, Tao. Who is this? It's Deb. Who Let's dis? We'll try the next one. Is that who I think it is? Was that Catherine? We really are in the Twilight Zone. Or at least it feels like it. I'm guessing that green light is beckoning me to it. Flip the switch, Crunk. All the way. Yeah, okay, there we go. So I guess that was the power of switch, huh? What are you? I can't tell. My vision is getting blurry. Ah, okay. Other way. What is in here? Ah, okay. Strong turns expected. Well, that's not good. But then again, the pressure is so extreme down here. Not that you'd be able to tell because I can still jump just fine. It's just the blurring effect. It makes it feel powerful. Jesus, did you see that? Stick to the lamplights. They won't go near them. I can't, Valglasser. It's important I reach Omicron. Our future depends on it. Calm down. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you. Okay, trail off there. That's fine. Flip the switch. Blue leads to towel, red leads to the climber, okay. Stay close to the lights. Right, right, there's a danger here. I'll probably die if I go off the light, off the beaten path, I remember now. I do remember seeing someone else um, play through this series, if I remember correctly. At the bottom of the ocean, if you stray from the lights, you'll die. Yeah, there's a monster. But it won't go near the lights, so as long as I stay near the lights, I should be good, right? That's the game's way of making sure that you don't stray off path, you know? It's one of those, it appears to be open, but it's really not kind of deals. You, you, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Mission logs, huh? Dried squid, frilled shark. What? 
Circled around, tried to eat the dry squid. Unlikely to frequency his depth an anomaly. Giant squid. Observation unknown. And we'll attack anything. Still hard to determine how it has affected their behavior. Beyond their apparent aggressive and affinity with light, the creatures seem to hunt something particular, something not present in this ecosystem. You know, like robots. Tasty robots. It seems that they're all out of everything except for those two. Lures. Humpback whale. Population size. Squid. And anglerfish. Error. Unable to load data. Good to know. Well, that's unfortunate. If you can't load data, can you at least load lore? Nah. He's a psychopath. You probably don't want to load that. Star Trek jokes aside, I should probably move on. Uh oh, I'm out of the light. If I follow this line though, I should be able to get to where I need to go, right? There's lights right there. Yes, indeedy. I just have to follow the light. Normally walking towards the light would be a bad thing, but in my case, it's a lifesaver. Run towards the light, my son. That is only where you will find salvation. If this game is getting very symbolic or I'm overthinking things again. Hard to say. Just follow the lights and you should be good. You should be fine, right? What the? Well, that was weird. Did the lights just turn red? Uh-oh. That can't be good. What the? Oh, crap. Go towards the lights. Quickly. Quickly. You'll die. Okay, good. Run towards the light. Do not stray from the path of light, or you'll die horribly. There is no death that is worse than being picked apart by freaking fish, like piranhas. That has to be a horrible death, a horrible fate, being ripped to pieces. I don't know if this robot body is capable of feeling pain, but he seems to react to stimuli, so I'm going to assume that at least would not feel pleasant for him. Good. I made it. Insufficient power, though. I guess we'll have to give it sufficient power now, won't we? Tao, can you hear this? Anyone there? This is Tao? Who is this? This is Ian Peterson of yes. Theta calling. I got a team with me, and we're about half a kilometer from Tau. What? How, how did... You came in the climber? Listen, we're having a really hard time with this sector. Heavy turbulence is making it difficult to move forward, and the wildlife you got is absolutely rabid. The storm comes and goes. The instruments show the weather is relatively fair right now. You should move out as... The power. Let's turn it on. Okay, good. And I may as well shove my fist into that. Those fish took a chunk out of me. Excellent. Much better. Now that I'm in the right frame of mind and I'm not woozy. Although things appear to have gotten a little darker around here. Like a lot darker, actually. I need a flashlight, pretty much, to see. Oh, uh, okay. That wiring is not so connected. I'm gonna need some way to turn the power back on. Garage. So the power didn't actually come back on. Also, healing myself may have been a mistake. Ah, okay, now I understand. Control. Observatory, landing, tau. K-1 
Can I redirect power? Recall. What the? Is that a good guy or a bad guy? I can't tell. Uh oh. Was I supposed to follow it? It is light, so I take it following it is the good is the right thing to do. Don't leave me here. Don't leave me to die. Helper robot. I assume it's a helper robot, I don't know. Don't leave me here. Oh, thank you, robot. I don't know if you're a good guy or a bad guy, but I need your light right now because otherwise the, the monsters will get me. So you're about as good of a shot as I have of actually making it to my destination. I will trust you, unknown robot. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Not good. Okay. I, I, I found my way to the light, but where's the next light? Probably this way. I see lights. And I don't know where to go. I'll have to trust in the light. Okay, good. There are more lights. This way. This way. Come on, buddy. Don't lose hope now. We're so close. Well, as long as I have my own flashlight, I'm not completely without light. That would suck if I was. It would really suck. I would really be up the creek without a paddle then. Okay, just keep finding lights. Light is good. Light is comforting. Light is navigation. Light means that I'm going the right way. Because the developers wouldn't put lights... They wouldn't put light breadcrumbs in front of me if it wasn't the right way, right? Obviously the light... Really? Really? You put an angler fish? Wow, you are a douche. How could you? How could you? You deceived me. I thought light was supposed to be good, but you deceived me. What a prick. Now where do I go? If I had to guess, I have to go in the other direction of that angler fish, which would be this way. I, I don't know. I can't see anything. That cave looks more inviting than wherever the hell I'm going. What the? Am I stuck here? Nope. Wait. What the? Did I glitch through the environment somehow? I think I did. Wait, I didn't do... I really didn't do anything. All I did was follow the intended path. Was I not supposed to have made it this far? Was the game expecting me to die and that's why it didn't bother? It didn't bother to make collision for that because it expected me to die before reaching that? I don't know what's going on. Is that light or is that an anglerfish? I can't tell anymore. Okay, good. It's an actual light. Good. Excellent. Make it to the light, man. That's all you gotta do. Uh oh. There's a creature. Leave me alone. Leave me alone, you freak. And the game's crashing, isn't it? Nope, it was frozen for a second. That's just, that's just messed up, man. 
I don't even know if I can trust the light anymore. And if I can't trust the light, then who can I trust? It's like everything wants to kill me. I thought the light was supposed to be my friend, but no. The light is a backstabber, just like everything else. I can't trust anyone. Not even Catherine, and definitely not myself. Because I will lie to myself constantly. Oh boy. Leave me alone, you freak. Turn my light off. Don't even look at the damn thing. Okay, good. It's gone. I guess we're playing red light, green light. If you see it, that's red light, which means stop. Unless you want to die. And I don't want to die. I have no intentions of dying just yet. Simon may want to die, but I want to live. No matter how twisted things must things shall get, I still have a survival instinct. And I will ride that wave as far as it, it, it takes me. Good. The fact that it auto-saved and that there is a building up ahead means that I have reached my destination. That's great. Excellent. See, things work out. Kinda. I'm probably just presenting myself as a meal for that crazy robot, but you know what? Screw it. I guess we all gotta face our destiny eventually. At least the game hasn't crashed. Even if it crashed now, it wouldn't really make a difference. Because it's gone like 27 minutes without crashing, so no matter what, at least the game isn't crashing. Ironically, I thought that Slime Rancher would be the replacement, but Slime Rancher is screwing up far more than this game. Besides, how can an indie, how could a, a ranching game where you're hunting down cute slimes be a suitable replacement for a game where you're being hunted by monsters? Although I suppose you could say that you're the monster in Slime Rancher. Nah. Okay, don't don't mess with me like this. I guess putting it into Windows 7 compatibility mode um, has left it not entirely stable, to say the least. Yeah, I've been happier to be inside. Now let's find the Ark. Although, at least, I mean, I will take some. Slight instability over just straight up crashing, you know? Access log. Okay, that's cool. Suit status. Signal lost. Okay, the third one is active, apparently. Never mind. Don't know why I thought that would be anything. Welcome to town. What's left of it? Are you guys alright? What happened here? We ran out of real food long ago. People have been getting sick. Haven't heard from anyone in months. No shit, they all think you're dead down here. Some failed evac story circulating in... Okay. That's fun. Oh yes, healing time! Good, thank goodness. I hate it when the game starts screwing up the end... The interface starts screwing up because you're you're damaged. I don't I don't want to turn it off because I'm pretty sure that's the way it's meant to be. It's it's meant to be disorientating. That way you'll want to be restored as quickly as possible. If that even makes any sense. Wow, that looks similar to the robot that Catherine was in before I turned her into the Omni Tool. What the? Okay, I guess I'm here, and I have to go there. I guess. Okay. That's inspiring confidence, isn't it? I guess no more data buffs for me. Open channel, then hold microphone while talking. Okay, then. Hmm. I shudder to think what's on the other side of this, but oh well. I guess I'm taking the plunge, huh? just about done with my playthrough anyway, so... Oh. 
I didn't even have to enter that room, really. Oh, ominous. Unfortunately, I'm all out of time, so as this door ominously opens, I must say that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like cliffhangers. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.